Thank you very much. It's an honour and a privilege to be here. Thank you, Daria, for putting together this uh, incredible event. I've been listening to the speakers and getting excited myself about the future, and I'm already very excited. So I'm the COO of SingularityNet. So SingularityNet is the world's leading decentralized AI marketplace. We were founded in 2017 by Dr. Ben Gertzel. We're the OGs of AI in crypto, and we're actually the OGs of AI anyway, full stop, because Dr. Ben Gertzel has been working on artificial general intelligence since 1998. He built his first WebMind engine, and what we bring with us is decades of research into the most advanced, most useful artificial intelligence technologies of all time that we are building AGI for a beneficial, benevolent singularity for the benefit of all humankind. Now, we're working on a timeline of three to seven years at Singularity Net for the development of human level artificial general intelligence. We've built the technology stack. We've built what we need for this. And I was at uh, in Boston at MIT a few weeks ago in a session similar to this with, with investors. And someone there said there are only about 10,000 serious AI developers in the world. And so with the AI revolution coming, those what they said there was invest in all the AI projects you can find because the AI projects are, are the ones which are going to benefit the most during this artificial intelligence revolution. We're at the brink of the artificial intelligence revolution and it's been predicted to be bigger than the mobile and the internet revolutions combined. It's going to be the biggest the fastest and the vastest AI revolution, technology revolution in the history of humanity. We've seen with chat GPT this year, we've seen 9,900% growth in, in users. It's the fastest growing product in the history of humanity. The AI revolution is going to be huge. It's coming now and it's going to generate vast, unprecedented levels of technology-generated wealth. And it, it is our great goal that those, that those technologies will be decentralized, that the access to them will be decentralized, that we'll democratize access to technology-generated wealth. And this is what we're working at. We're at the very forefront of technology and the very forefront of development of these technologies. So that's Singularity Net, and as well as building a GI, which is our core artificial general intelligence core technologies, as well as building those, we're also working on seeding the use of those technologies across a number of strategically selected vertical markets. And today I'm going to present to you five investment opportunities of these businesses that we are seeding across vertical markets to use our singularity net core technologies. The first of these I'm going to talk about is Rejuve Biotech. Now Rejuve Biotech is an extraordinary project. We have got, it is not a crypto project, it's an equity project. We have got a population of Methuselah flies, three populations of Methuselah flies, a normal length lifespan control group, a, a long-lived control group and a super long-lived control group. And what we're doing with Rejuve Biotech is we are using our machine learning and our advanced transfer learning technologies to perform genetic analysis on these three populations of flies and to determine what is the ultimate what, what, what we can learn from them that will give us clues to human genome expressions and ultimately longevity and we're pushing towards immortality with the project. It's innovative and we'll be developing drugs based on what we find from flies. I don't know how many people know how many flies we've got in common how many genes we have in common with flies, but it's actually 70%. Humans are 70% in common with flies. And there's a huge amount we can learn from these Methuselah flies in this really, really innovative project. We're currently raising $5 million at a valuation of $50 million. 
to really take this research forward. The Rejuve Biotech project also works hand in hand with our Rejuve AI project, which is a network project, which works as, which has a longevity app and people submit their data. And so we get data, we get different markers, medical data from people all over the world that can be used for longevity research in humans. But then we can partner that research with the research that we're doing on our Methuselah flies. And so we have a unique database that is combined with fly data, combining genomic data from flies with data from humans to be able to really smash through and create any identify and create druggable drugs for any druggable targets L looking at the the big four of alzheimer's parkinson's heart disease and cancer of course this is led in the us by a amazing ceo we have there called kennedy and she's not with us today but she could certainly provide you with any information that you need. Uh, so that's Rejuve Biotech. I'm just coming on to, this is the Singularity Net ecosystem. We have these projects across DeFi. We've got Singularity DAO. Many of you know in the DeFi space, we have Rejuve and Rejuve Biotech in the in the healthcare space, we have our Awakening Health Project, which is robotics for healthcare, for elderly healthcare. We have in media, we have our Mindplex project and our Jam Galaxy project, which, which I'm going to talk through both of these in a moment. We have Singularity Studio True AGI providing services to enterprises. We have Hypercycle, which is a layer zero in incredibly resource optimized blockchain optimized for AI to AI interaction. We have Zarka, which I'm going to talk through, which is our smart neural symbolic large language models. Cogito is a tracer coin we launched just this year. We have NewNet, which is our decentralized processing platform. And we have Sophia Dow, which is uh, in process of KYC for its TGE under the name of Sophiaverse. At the center, we have our decentralized marketplace, we have our AI domain specific language, and we have our OpenCog Hyperon research platform. We're engineering the transition from narrow AI to artificial general intelligence. I touched upon this. Today's AI is all narrow. It can only do one thing. We're, we're building AI that's able to work across domains, that's able to generalize, and that's able to integrate all of the different AIs with each other on our OpenCog Hyperon platform. Um, and as I mentioned, our strategy is to seed our decentralized AI platform with our incredible technologies, which are absolutely frontier tech across a number of vertical industries. And I'll come back to talking you through our project now. Uh, so Singularity Net itself is not currently in a funding round, but we do have funding requirements right across our ecosystem that I'm going to talk to you about. So I'll start with our Jam, I'll move on to our Jam Galaxy platform. We've already talked about our um, we've already talked about our Rejuve Biotech. This is our Jam Galaxy project, which is about artists connecting with their fans better. I've been here at the UN with the Desdemona Rockstar Robot. We did a concert at AI for Good last week. And this project uniquely combines Web3 with the best in artificial intelligence, music generation and music generation tools to enable artists via Web3 to connect with their fans, to stream directly to their fans and to create music tools to expand their productivity and expand the range of music and the amount of output that an artist can produce in one time because the AI revolution is really all about expansion. It's about humans using artificial intelligence to massively expand our impact and massively expand our productivity and our ability to interface with the world and to earn. And so we really want to help musicians earn a, a, a better living. So it's not just the top 1% of musicians, but that all musicians are able to to flourish and thrive in this environment. Fantastic revenue model for this one. Clearly any form of streaming activities, use of the, the Musaic uh, products and a broad, broad global platform where artists all over the world can come, disintermediate the big streamers, the big streaming systems. So that's our Jam Galaxy project led by our amazing Desdemona robot. 
So Jam Galaxy is going at a valuation of $20 million and it is currently raising $1 million in seed funding before our TGE, hopefully sometime later this year, but that will be dependent on market conditions. Next up, Rejuve Biotech, unlocking the secrets of, of aging. This is, this is the project I touched on earlier. We're using novel AI technology. We are working with our bioatom space, our AGI technology stack, which we've built. The brilliant thing about flies is they have a very short R&D cycle. So the research and development can happen really fast because they have a very short life cycle measured in weeks compared to humans. You could do the same kind of analysis on humans, but you'd have to wait a long, long time to be able to actually see what the results are. Uh, as the previous speaker alluded to, AI in healthcare is absolutely huge and healthcare is, is generally a, a booming market right now. And this is a unique opportunity to work with very, very esteemed technologists who have been conducting research. Ben has been working with Dr. Ben Gertzel, our CEO. He's been working with Michael Rose, who first started this research maybe two decades ago. The flies themselves have been bred for 20 years selectively for, for, for longevity and for strong genes. And so it's, it's a fantastic opportunity at a really healthy valuation to come into a project that is really looking at the depths of genetic research combined with artificial intelligence, combined with the power of blockchain and the power of data. So Rejuve Biotech is currently raising $10 million against a valuation of 50 million. I did say 50 million earlier, I'm pleased. Um, so... We would be really delighted to speak with any investors interested in supporting this raise. It's an equity project. It's not going to be a token project, although it does work hand in hand with our Rejuve.ai tokenized network of data contributors and, and research data. Thank you so much. And uh, again, really, really nicely done. So my, my question for you is, where do you see the blockchain space or the protocol world going ultimately? Looking out three years, five years, seven years out, um, where do you envision it all heading? We are very, very strongly committed to decentralization at SingularityNet. And we're pushing the bounds of what a decentralized organization is. We've got a, a really exciting progressive decentralization program. And so we're moving our foundation decisions out into the hands of our community. Simultaneously, we're developing the most powerful AI tools ever invented. And it's utterly essential that those powerful AI tools are on blockchain, that they are governed by a decentralized community, that the ethics are governed by a decentralized community, and that the access to wealth is decentralized. So we see a future with blockchain, crypto, right heart and center of this new revolution of technologies for everyone instead of technologies for a monopoly.